Hey everybody, how's life treating ya? I'm Russ Robo, and welcome back. Uh, I just wanted to make a video talking about uh, what all the plans were for the channel coming up soon. I know I look uh, pretty funny with the beanie and the jacket and the shirt and the stuff. There's a reason for that. It got cold real fast. Um, it was 78 degrees three days ago. And then I think uh, day before yesterday, it was uh, about 71. And then we hit a cold front. It got down to the mid to lower 40s last night, or uh, last last night. And then this morning, now it is currently. Oh, what's the temperature outside? We're looking at uh, 36. Yeah, 30, 36 feels like 40. Can that actually show, show up? Yeah, yeah, you can actually see that. Feels like 30. Isn't that awful? That's, I mean, I know a lot of places get way, oh, focus, focus on me. Hey, right here, camera, camera, hey, guy, guy, hey, over here, this guy, this guy, get me, me right here. Camera's unfocused, all right, come on. Focus. Maybe just a little bit. Come on. There you go. Good boy. <laughs> um, anyway, what was the thing? Oh, yeah. I know a lot of places get a lot colder, but Florida's weird, man. 80 in the summer, then suddenly a cold front hits. The, um, the, the moisture comes off from the ocean, cold front comes in, boom. And all of a sudden it's 30. And, and you saw it. You saw it. Uh, so, that having been said, I'm all bundled up, even in my house, and I apologize for any audio disturbances because I got the heater running behind me, but it's a little bit of space heater, and I got uh, two of those plus a radiator heater, uh, and it's 61 in my house right now, so 61 degrees. That's comfortable to some folks, not to me. Um, what was the thing? Yeah, so, I mean, 61's pretty bad, but at least it's not 30, and my house being 30 degrees uh, warmer, on the inside than it is on the outside is pretty impressive considering that I haven't finished weatherproofing the house. I haven't finished. I haven't even started. Um, I got these weather strips that I can put underneath the windows because I can feel that draft. It's bad. Um, I need to get those set up and I also need to put something underneath the front door because there's a draft under that as well. Uh, so yeah, get your, get your houses winterproofed. It's time. It's happening now. Like right now. When's now? Now is now. <laughs> if you wait, you'll miss it. You'll miss now. Now is the time. Now is the time. But that's not originally what I... Uh, <laughs> I didn't come here to talk about the weather. I came here to tell you that I'm going on vacation soon. And I'm going to be out of town for a couple of days. But I'm making a few uh, videos the, um, that will be on the channel while I'm gone. They're, they'll be automatically uploaded. I haven't started them yet. But <laughs> uh, I'm going to get to them right after this. I... I'm, I shouldn't promise. I've broken so many promises already. Um, but basically, actually, there is one video I have ready. It's not on the channel yet, like scheduled, but it's been recorded and fully edited. It's my first ever YouTube short. Um, now, let me clarify by making a short description of what YouTube shorts are. YouTube is promoting short, I think it's 15 to 30 second clips which are called YouTube Shorts, which is, I think, their way of sorting, uh, sort of getting into the whole what used to be the TikTok and Vine sphere. Um, they're doing YouTube Shorts now, so I wanted to give it a try. It's just something to... Uh, it's a short video, which catches, people, uh, catches people's attention sometimes a lot more often than, let's say, a 30-minute or an hour-long video. Because, I mean, sometimes people are only on a 15-minute break, or they just want to watch a funny video when they're going from one place to another, or who knows? They might be waiting in a doctor's office, for all I know. They don't have a lot of time to look at a big, long video or a big, long intro. YouTube Shorts are a way to show your audience a little bit of what your channel is about if they've only got a little tiny bit of time. So they might see that and think, well, that was just a little 15 sec or 15... Yeah, 15 second video. Maybe I'll check back on the channel later sometime. And who knows? They might check back months or even years later. 
but it doesn't matter as long as they take a look again. So YouTube Shorts are just a little bit away at getting people's audience, like getting an audience uh, a little, uh, what do you call it? It's kind of like a uh, little appetizer. Yeah, yeah, appetizer. But I got one of those ready. Um, that one I just need to get uploaded. It's already edited. It'll be ready. Um, then I'm gonna go on vacation. I'm going on a trip. Uh, gonna try to do. I'm gonna try to visit a friend, and we might be going uh, to an amp guard event. That'll be a lot of fun. Uh, what else was there? There was one other. I may uh, be incorporating a green screen. I've been I've been informed by a friend of mine that the white background here is a little bit too. I don't know, vague, blank, or whatever. It's not interesting enough. You gotta spice it up a little bit. I could hang some posters or something, but I also need to get like one of those, um, what do you call it? The, uh, I was thinking a, uh, it's, I think it's called a sound booth. It's basically just a, a three by three room sectional divider that goes directly behind me. Like you, basically it's a freaking sound cubicle. I could get a sound cubicle. <laughs> Um, it'll help my audio sound better, and then I can just hang a green sheet over it, a neon green sheet over it, and I can do green screen if I want, or I can decorate it and make it, you know, kind of like how uh, Markiplier, Jacksepticeye, they got like the, the, the lights and the posters and the stuff. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about. Uh, but I hope that YouTube short, you might get a laugh out of it. If not, eh, whatever. But if somebody gets a giggle out of it, then it's worth it. I'm going to try to make those every now and again. I'm not sure. Um, we're still doing a Monday, Wednesday, Friday thing. Uh, I missed Monday, and today is Tuesday, so I'm hoping this will come out on Wednesday. <laughs> I'm working on it. It's whatever. As long as the videos are entertaining, I don't care. I recently got, um, what was it? I recently got, I guess, uh, blasted by a bunch of internet trolls on Facebook. They said I was. They said my face was funny looking. I don't care. Um, or that I was ugly. It got to me at the time, but I had been drinking. So now that I'm sober, I don't care if they think I'm ugly. But I did change my Facebook profile to a guy with a bag on his head. So I guess since I was drinking, I was still, um, what was it? Uh, what's the word I'm looking for? I was hungover. I was really sad. I was sad. I, I, I had a tear coming down my eye. People thought I was ugly. I don't care. Um, yeah, gonna get some YouTube shorts out. Gonna have lots of cool stuff on the channel. Stay tuned for that. I'm glad we're, uh, I think we're gonna stay at 500 subscribers or above as long as I can continue uploading new content. Uh, when I was at like 511, I thought, you know, maybe that'll drop down below. But a friend of mine whose channel I'll put, in a, uh, uh, whose channel I will put as a link in the description below. Uh, he gave me a shout out, which uh, helped me get a few more subscribers. So I think we're steadying out here at around over 500. I'm going to try for more this year. We're in 2022 now. It's a whole new time, whole new, same shit, different day. <laughs> uh, that's, uh, oh, that's my alarm. I got to go read. You know, you got to educate yourself. Get your brain, get your brain flowing. Keep it going. <laughs> uh, brain is important. You know, sometimes my mind don't brain, but sometimes, other times my brain don't mind. All right, well, I'm glad I could talk with you here. Sometimes it's just important to get some words out to the audience, whether it's formal or informal or just bad or not so good. I don't, it, it's whatever, you know? Just be yourself. Do what you do, and people who care about you and care about your channel and your content will stick around. And the people that have, cons if they have constructive criticism, like they tell you your content sucks, but they give you a way to fix it, that's constructive. But if they have non-constructive criticism, they just say, well, your content sucks, you're ugly, I hate your backgrounds, but they don't give you any suggestions on how to fix it, they, they just don't worry about them. Keep doing what you do. I have almost 500 videos on the channel. I'm going to try to keep the videos on the channel up to date with the number of subscribers on the channel. I'm going to keep them videos flowing. I really like them. I have a lot of fun. And my friends that offer me constructive criticism, I appreciate you. I appreciate you. And those trolls on Facebook that say I'm ugly, I ain't worried about them. This is a face. This is a handsome face. Look at all that chin. 
<laughs> I, I, um, <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I guess my advice is to just stay away from like Facebook drama. I, all I did was laugh react to one photo and say uh, I was having a bad day and now I'm not and somebody went absolutely ape crazy and they're like have you looked at yourself in a mirror lately keep having a bad day I mean I wasn't trying to fat shame nobody I mean everybody's got their tastes and preferences and then and then she blew up my Facebook profile picture she blew up my Facebook profile picture and nine separate people laughed at it <laughs> I mean I mean say I got a goofy face but but don't call me ugly damn Goofy is fine. I can deal with that. But I don't want to be, I mean, ugly. I mean, it's like I can only, I can only cover up so much of this ugly ass face. Is that better? Is that better? You fucking hole. <laughs> All right. This is it for this video. Later days, folks. I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Oh,